This is a tutorial on how to download GPS files from Roadrunner's website and what you can do with the files. To begin, you have to log into your account. If you don't already have an account, it only takes a few seconds to create one. Once logged in, you can go to the interactive tour map to research a tour that you're interested in. Please keep in mind that the map shows every tour in our archives and you don't necessarily have access to all of them. Access depends on your subscription history, although you can get full access to the archives with the Catch Me Up deal found on the bottom of your accounts page. For this tutorial, let's pick the state of Montana to research. When I select it from the drop down menu, I see all of the tour markers. I can also view the tour outlines that give me a better sense of the area it covers. I'll choose the Rocky Mountains Part 2 tour article. I can download the GPS file and tank back map directly from the pop-up bubble. Once it's downloaded to your computer, pull up the website gpsvisualizer.com. There, upload the Rocky Mountains Part 2 GPS file. Select the Google Maps Street View for a familiar layout that's also the easiest to look at. Now you can clearly see the entire tour route that was mapped out by Roadrunner. This website is just to look at the routes, see details, check roads, but it is not a planning tool. To alter the route or upload it to your GPS unit, open the file in Basecamp. If you don't have Basecamp, you can download it for free from Garmin's website. In Basecamp, go to File, Import, and select the Rocky Mountain Part 2 file. Once loaded, you can work on the route and make changes like the start and end location, add detours, or simply take it and upload it to your unit. For this tutorial, I'll upload it to my Zumo. Basecamp will ask you if it should recalculate the route before uploading. We recommend clicking no, otherwise it could happen that the route is changed. The recalculation step also takes a very long time. It's just unnecessary. Once the transfer is complete, you can eject your device and follow the unit steps to start using the route. Roadrunner already has more than 350 tours in its archives. The Catch Me Up deal is the most cost-effective way to get full access. It takes every issue you don't already have access to and charges $3 per issue. That's less than half the cost of purchasing them individually. Basecamp does take some practice and a test route from Roadrunner is a great way to try out its capabilities. Happy planning and safe travels!